What's going on guys? Hope you're having a good day. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and click the subscribe button before uh, you go ahead and watch more of this video. But I wanted to touch base on marketing, especially since that we're coming into the, the season of 2018 in spring. Now's the time everybody's preparing, getting their ideas together, their marketing plan together. Um, so I wanted to ask you guys and talk to you guys about it. You know, what is your uh, preferred way of marketing? Maybe you have a list you like to do A, B, and C or whatever it may be. Comment that below. But uh, we're focusing like we did last year, but we focused even more this year on our website, putting up more uh, uh, blog posts and all kinds of other fun stuff on there just to amp it up a little more. Um, we are focusing on Google reviews this year heavily just as much as we did last year uh, we're gonna do the same this year and then then some because Google re reviews are like freaking gold I'm sure many of you guys know that and if you don't know about Google reviews well well you have to know about them. but anyways if you don't have any focus really hard this year to get them so uh, Google reviews and I put that in there as a form of marketing because uh, you know people see that and if you can show them that some way on your website or or maybe a flyer somehow stuff like that and so get, get Google reviews are awesome uh, so website um, Craigslist ads we've we've done that uh, in the past and they work pretty well for us you do every once in a while you're gonna get tire kickers and not the exact person you want but we've had pretty good success with Craigslist ads. Uh, you know, it's really simple. You just create the, the title, a catchy title, maybe throw some emojis in that title, just to grab someone's attention, add plenty of photos in there, and add a image um, and offer. So the first picture on your Craigslist ad, uh, make that the offer. So it just brings more attention to it. Instead of it just being a mower, that's just sitting there with you waving or, or showing a picture of a lawn you did. Don't put that as your first one. Put the first photo that you have for the Craigslist because that's the thumbnail as you many of you know if you search Craigslist. Put that one as your offer and make it really nice. It's probably not going to be too hard to beat other people in your area because most people just throw up pictures of their work which is cool but that's the only thing they throw up. So if you put the offer and then pictures of your work it just grabs their attention more and then when you do the this is going into like a how to do video but and when you do the uh, the, the description just make it really simple you, you know don't elaborate you don't have to go too crazy um, a little description of your service uh, some bullet points of we take care we do this a B and C service the area and phone number uh, tell them, call now, blah, blah, blah. Um, so Craigslist is, and if you guys want, I, I, I said on Instagram about like making some Craigslist thing, but I couldn't really figure out how I wanted to do that. So if you guys want to elaborate more on the whole Craigslist ad idea, just let me know, comment uh, below, and uh, just, just let me know. Maybe maybe I'll make another video more in detail of like me screen sharing on the computer. Anyways, uh, so website, Google reviews, Craigslist ad, um facebook facebook's hit or miss for us you know we, we've tried that before and just posting on our page and and actually uh when it comes to facebook groups like in classified groups to get pick people up in uh craigslist actually has worked out way more for us than posting in them um in them groups uh i don't know why because a lot of people i see a lot of people do have success uh with facebook groups and getting customers uh, so, so we're gonna probably do some more Craig's. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, Facebook ads for our page this year a few times. Haven't had that much success, but if you keep trying, something's gonna have to work, right? Um, flyers, uh, flyers or flyers and or door hangers. I can't really, can't really put my my finger on which one. Um, if one has worked out better for you guys than the other, uh, comment that below as well. I don't, you know, I, I'm not sure. I'm kind of curious about that one. 
So let me know your experience on flyers and or door hangers, because I would love to try that out. And then we're gonna partner up with a realtor friend of ours, um, and we're gonna do a, a flyer type situation, and it's gonna be like 50-50 for the cost, because she's gonna have half, and we'll have the other half. So we're gonna try that out um, and see what happens there. And what else? I think that's, I think that's about it that I can think of right now. I'm sure we'll come up with some more ideas along the way as we go and stuff like that. But I think that's about it uh, at the moment. Uh, website, number one, um, get Google reviews for that. As I already said, uh, Craigslist, um, Facebook uh, ads, maybe, uh, and flyers and or door hangers. So, let me know what you guys are thinking. What are you guys gonna try this year? What has worked for you previously? Um, just comment below. Thank you guys for watching and uh, we'll catch you later. Peace. Gentile, black man, white.